All right, so it took me a little longer to film a part two, um, but this is kind of the tools that I picked up over the last probably three or four months. Um, I showed you what I took to work, uh, and it's kind of some of the stuff I uh, have at home. First thing I got here is a 10-piece Mac plier set. Um, these are the Made in China ones, um, but I picked these up for 20 bucks. That was a good enough deal uh, to have as, uh, some pliers to throw in a grab-and-go bag. Um, only issue I really saw with them was uh, surface rust. None of the cutting blades or jaws are marred up or anything. Um, doesn't look like they were used too, too much. There's no gaps or chips in the diagonal cutters. Um, yeah, overall, I was pretty happy with it. And for $20, I figured it's perfect. Uh, it's got most of the pliers I'll need for a grab-and-go bag. Um, next thing I got, uh, like I said, I in my previous video, I pretty much put everything away um but next thing i got was a uh, eight piece i believe it's eight piece um three quarter drive snap-on socket set uh, and it goes from half inch down to uh three quarter um and i mainly got this for work but i don't really need it every day so i figured i'd just bring them home um i have some shallow three quarter sockets at work and so i just have the deeps here at home uh I can't remember what I paid, but I know it wasn't much. That's kind of why I jumped on it. It does have one Mac uh, inch and five sixteenths, but everything else is a uh, snap on. Um, and then I uh, also got some extra uh, snap on 12.3 quarters. Um, and then a deep uh, two and three quarter pinion socket. Uh, again, uh, all these are deep sockets and Figure rather than clog up my work box, I'll just have them at home. And if I ever need them, need them, uh, I can always take them back. Uh, next thing I got is a 23-piece Matco shallow metric set. And these go from a 32 mil down to a 10 millimeter right here. Um, and then uh. The, the ones I have flipped over are broken. So I actually picked this whole set up for $60. Um, it's the older uh, Matco set. Um, so they're not uh, they're not painted. And so I have three broken sockets. Um, and I just have them flipped upside down. So I remember to warranty them at some point. Um, and then I got a 16-piece deep set of Matco sockets. Some of these have been warrantied out. So it's got the newer... Uh, painted um, painted size on the, the socket but for the most part they're the older set um, I paid a little extra for these I can't remember exactly what I paid but uh, I just wanted a matching Matco set versus uh, any other brand um, and then I believe the last thing for sockets is I got a snap on 12 point socket set um, and again these are all metric uh, and this goes from uh, 8 millimeter up to uh, 24. Um, and as far as sockets, I believe that's it. Um, like I said, uh, I'm bound to forget some stuff because this is uh, over a long period of time. As a matter of fact, uh, I did pick up some Snap-on FRX sockets, the flare nets. Um, and I just took the spares home. So I have an 18, a 10, and a 12. Um, and then I also got a snap-on spark plug socket and then uh, a Matco extra deep socket uh, for my Honda. Um, and I believe that's it for sockets. And then uh, the only other stuff I got is uh, some wrenches. Um, I already went over the blue points, the stubbies. And then uh, this is the other set of snap-on angled wrenches and it goes from 10 to 27 and then 3 8 to an uh, inch and a quarter um, the metric set I have at work as well as this uh, standard set they were uh, engraved by the previous owner but uh, again I picked these up so cheap I didn't I didn't really worry about it um, and then I also got some uh, matching uh, Matco flare nut sockets Got my SAE sock uh, set on this side, and then uh, the metric set over here. 
can't remember what I paid for these. I believe it was like $80 per. Um, but yeah, again, I believe that's it uh, as far as uh, the home tools. Um, if I remember, I'll try and post a video, but otherwise, um, as always, thanks for watching.